I just wanted to put this out there a disclaimer that for all the books search up trigger warnings I don't know if they are for any of these books but just search them up just in case because we never know hello everyone welcome back to my channel so this video it's about holidays book recommendations and I only have one physical book that is holiday themed so the other ones will be on Kindle Unlimited I don't have physical copy I only have one and I will recommend some that seems interesting but I haven't read them so this video will be a little chaotic I will not really talk much about the books why because I haven't read them but I don't know if they're good or bad I'm just recommending them and these are books that I will probably read in the month of December so without further ado let's get started okay so let's start with the only physical book that I have and you probably saw that this book if you saw my last video which was me going to the bookstore and you know trying to find new books and this is the royal holiday by Jasmine Gil Gilori I'm sorry I'm not good with names but these seem so interesting and look I love books that have um, these type of covers they're just so freaking cute and the sparkles and everything and you know it's really holiday and it has holiday in the title so and I was like why not recommend it so then the others are on Kindle Unlimited Kindle is my bestie and like as you can see I have a lot of options so let me just okay there it is so the first one it's a book that it's called eating her christmas cookies i know by elena jacobs it's a holiday romantic comedy and i saw that and i saw that there's five books they're standalones but they follow the same characters so from what i can see there's five books of this and the five books are uh, different brothers. So like I said, eating her Christmas cookies is the first one. And the brothers that we follow along are the Frost brothers. They're billionaire. So the first book follows Jack and Chloe. And from what I can see, it's Grumpy Sunshine. I read a little bit of the hypnosis. And from what I read, I think like she goes to a baking show. She loves to bake. She loves Christmas she loves everything related to Christmas she goes to a baking show and Jack is one of the judges his company is sponsoring the show but he hates Christmas he hates everything related to Christmas so like I said grumpy sunshine obviously they will see a lot of each other because they are in the same show but I'm really excited to see that like I said like he hates Christmas and she loves it so it seems really interesting so I was like why not and obviously like the girl that I am I can't read a book without reading all of them they all seem really interesting but I found this one and obviously I wanted I already have five books christmas book so it's amazing the second one is taste her christmas cookies and these follow holly and owen i don't know much about it um i think this one doesn't have her details but i think it's grumpy sunshine as well okay i think it's this one is kind of similar she loves um christmas he doesn't like it and i think think um wait how do they kind of meet i think she's in the show as well and he may be like known her from there i don't know i'm not sure but it's kind of like that then the third one is frosting her cookies christmas cookies sorry and this one follows jonathan i don't know we don't know the name of the girl yet but jonathan he's another frost brother and what is this one about I think it's all related to the show and really Christmas like they're stand connected standalones so yeah the fourth one it's a lick <laughs> I'm sorry this title make me laugh licking her Christmas cookies so this is about math I think from what I've read but it doesn't give really much details either then the fifth one it's resting Grinch face so this one 
is the one that I'm most excited for because it's reverse grumpy sunshine. She's the grumpy, he's the sunshine. Well, I think, I'm not sure, but he seemed more like the chill one compared to her. And I think it's small town romance because she's from a small town. I think, I'm not sure, like I said. But all of these are really like, really Christmas themed and I'm really excited about that. Then another book that seems really interesting is A Very Bossy Christmas by Alexis Winter. This one is an enemy to lover book. Uh, I think there's fake dating if not fake marriage um like i said the mc he's really bossy i think the title says it all and i think it's grumpy sunshine i'm not sure i'm not sure she's the sunshine but he's bossy and grumpy so yeah this is a book it seems really spicy so i'm really excited about that then it so these ones are three books Kane Christmas. I think it's a series. There are three books. I don't know if there's it's a standalone. <clears throat> it doesn't say, but the first one it's called My Fake Christmas Fiance. It follows Wesley Kane. I'm pretty sure she he's the maybe the rich one. I don't know. I think it follows brothers, but I'm not sure. So the first one is this one, like I said, and she he's her boss. I think yeah and they're like in a fake engagement for business purpose uh, purpose but it seems like they're getting married and she had no idea so she was like wait I agree for this craziness like fake engagement but not for marriage and she's kind of panicking so apparently she's a nerdy girl and he's like the playboy I don't know how that follows but I think I'm pretty sure he's her boss but i'm really excited about that it seems really interesting and it's only like 160 pages which is amazing that's a quick read so the next one is santa baby maybe what a funny name so that one is she loves Christmas and she's assigned to do the decoration like she's a designer for the company and okay doesn't say any of the names of the characters but that's all and the third book is how my brother's best friend stole Christmas what a funny name okay okay they're all uh, under 200 pages which is amazing okay so it's a best friend a uh, brother's best friend romance so next is the Christmas pack, which is this book by V. Keyland and Penelope Ward. I'm sorry if I'm batching those names, but uh, this one, fake dating. I don't know much about it, but it seems like it's fake dating. So it seems like there's another Christmas pack in my list. I didn't even notice, but this one is by Meg Easton and uh, it's a mountain spring Christmas. Okay, it follows Noel and Jack and she doesn't, like she used to love Christmas but because her grandma passes away, she like skip it now. And Jack, he doesn't like Christmas at all. But his sister has a son and her sister like tells him, oh I want my son to have a magical Christmas, help me with that. So then he asks help from Noel, which he is his employee, she works with him so she works for him sorry and he asked for help and together they show the magic of Christmas and along the way may happen some things I'm pretty sure then is the mistletoe pack by Joel Lovett I'm sorry if I'm not saying that right it says two single 30 years old one marriage pack and a night in Vegas that's about to change everything on Christmas Eve eight years ago Evie and Dan made a pact. If they were not married by 30, they were going to marry each other. Of course, neither of them took it seriously. Even if Dan has always been mesmerized by Evie's beautiful smile, Evie has always fancy Dan her best friend's brother oh I like that so this one seems really good they made a promise to each other and wow that's really good then it's the holiday x file by Jennifer Peel and this one 
I'm sorry. Okay, so she caught her husband cheating on her and then, you know, I'm probably sure they divorced, they're not together anymore and comes along her ex-boyfriend's best friend, Noah. Oh my god, the best friend. We love that, we love that. But it's not her brother's best friend, it's her ex-boyfriend's best friend. That's what makes it better. But, deems I'm really excited! Then, the next book is A Cross Country Christmas by Courtney Walsh. Walsh. Sorry for ruining your name. But this one is about the girl that isn't a fan of Christmas. So, and his brother and wife are expecting a baby. So he arranged a ride home, back home with his best friend Will. Damn! Okay, and she used to like him and she's been trying to forget him like he's her childhood crush for more than 10 years That is a lot. So she will have to go with him. Oh my god So it's kind of a road trip and probably there there will be happening some things that we're excited books I'm happy with my picks then the next book is the mistletoe bet by Moran Moore. I'm sorry again with the names so this one is about a girl that is going back home for the holidays and she's not really excited because she doesn't like Christmas and then she's going to run into her childhood crush and brother's best friend Parker maybe it's small town romance I'm not sure she hates Christmas he loves it we love that that is exciting last but not least this one is one I've been eyeing for quite some time I don't know when it came out but I don't know. It's this the season for revenge a holiday romantic comedy by Morgan Elizabeth I love the cover of this book like it's so cute. I love it. So Abby is waiting for her Her boyfriend they have been dating for four years and she's waiting for him to propose Until one day he leaves her because she's not serious enough. So what she do she goes with her with his boss So she sleeps with his boss. I think I don't know. Look, no, she start dating his boss. Damn, girl! He's called uh, Damien. Damien Martinez. She has to convince him, like, to date to get revenge on her ex boyfriend. <laughs> I think it's a really spicy book, but that one is the one that I'm most most excited about. Like, I really want to read that book. I'm excited for these holidays books. Maybe I'll read them in December, January. I don't know, because for me, January, it's still the holidays. Everybody thinks differently. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. And I will see you in my next video, guys. Bye!